Dust storms happen in the western U.S. out in the desert areas all the time, but in the Midwest, it's not very common. They're actually very rare, but it can happen. Now, the proper term for a dust storm is called a haboob, and I know that's a goofy name, but that's the right way to refer to it, and it happened a few weeks ago in the Midwest. It went through northwest Iowa, parts of South Dakota and Nebraska. This is a view of that storm. This came from Amy. She sent us this picture, and you can see that dust embedded within storm clouds. There was a big storm going through that area, but then it was picking up the dust as well. Another picture from Liz of that haboob in the Midwest. So what exactly are these things? What are dust storms? Well, here's how they happen. They're caused by strong winds, and those winds are often coming from thunderstorms, which is exactly what happened with this last system. The wind will pull dust from the ground up into the air, and that dust may be along the ground from, say, farm debris left over from farming and planting. It could also be just because the ground is so dry. That dust then gets swirled around, and basically this big wall of debris gets formed, and this, of course, can cause problems. It can create hazardous driving conditions because the visibility goes down. It also can cause mechanical issues for airplanes. That gets into the engines or it gets into the plane and can cause Big problems. And of course, you probably would not be surprised to hear this at all. It can cause breathing and health issues because look at all of that dust. It can essentially really reduce the uh, air quality when we see these types of things. So again, it's a pretty rare setup. It's a pretty rare phenomenon in the Midwest to have any sort of dust storm or haboob type setup, but it is not unheard of here in Iowa. So something we always have to watch out for a lot of times associated with those big thunderstorms. We actually had this happen in central Iowa back in December of 2021. We had a derecho storm that moved across our state and in between all those thunderstorms, a little bit of dust got kicked up. For the Local 5 Weather Lab, I'm meteorologist Brandon Lawrence.